Good evening. This is Jay, the man who reads news articles. Now let's see, which one shall I read today? Okay, here we go. I've won to make a comeback despite vote rigging controversy of Produce 48. After almost a year of silence, Ice One is making a comeback on February 17th with their first full-length album, Bloom Eyes. This is going to be Ice One's first album release in 10 months since the release of their second mini-album, Hard Eyes, in last April. This also means Ice One will engage in promotional activities in Korea for the first time since the outbreak of the vote-rigging controversy surrounding Mnet's Produce 48, which is the program that gave birth to Ice One. Ice One made their debut through the audition program Produce 48, which was the third season of Mnet's Produce series. Originally, Ice One was scheduled to make a comeback on November 11, 2019. But right around then, head producer An Jun Young and chief producer Kim Yong Bum of the Produce series were all over the media, and it was revealed that the votes were rigged on the Produce series, including Produce 48. As a result, Ice One put a temporary halt in their K-pop activities. Idol group X1, which was created through Produce X101, ended up being disbanded. Meanwhile, on January 23rd, Mnet announced Ice One's upcoming comeback. After months of time off, Ice One will be resuming their career in K-pop. When making the announcement on the group's comeback, Mnet stated, it wasn't the fault of the artists who debuted or the trainees or the agencies that caused this situation to occur. Therefore, we would appreciate it if you would warmly support Eyes One members who suffered mentally without having done anything wrong. It was reported that the agencies of Eyes One members had lengthy discussions on this matter. Eventually, they agreed to resume Eyes One's activities in K-pop and began preparing for their comeback. The upcoming album, Bloom Eyes, which is the first full-length album by Eyes One, was named based on the combination of the word Bloom and the name Eyes One. It will be the finale of the Flower series, following the previous singles La Vian Rose and Violetta. The album is already on pre-sale on various online music sites. And by February 4th, the album had not only dominated sales charts in Korea, but it had also topped the online pre-sale chart of Japan's Tower Records. With their comeback just around the corner, Ice One's global outreach has already been reflected in chart performance. However, there is some negative reaction from people on the internet as well. They say, X1 was disbanded, so how come Ice One wasn't? We don't want to see the promotional activities of a group that consists of rigged members who deceived fans. With many people welcoming the comeback of Ice One who previously set the record for most albums sold by a female group and others pointing fingers at the group for the vote rigging controversy, K-pop fans around the world have their eyes on Eyes One to see how their comeback will be received. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please hit the like button and subscribe for more upcoming content. Also, you can check out the latest news about K-pop boy groups and girl groups on doyuram.com, so be sure to check it out. This has been Jay, the man who reads news articles.